Nearly half of the city's population is non-white and many are poor. They do not patronize the symphony or the museum. They don't use the Coliseum or the airport very much. I learned about the Black Panther Party through news and magazines, and I was impressed because they were taking action. They were standing up against police brutality. They were standing up against the system in a way that had rarely been seen. Michael, we're so excited to have you. And Roz and Lester, thank you both for carving out all this time, and we're so excited for this project. We use 106 cameras to capture someone from every possible angle, and what you get on the other side is a fully 3D capture of that performance. For applications like documentary and archival performance, any application where you would want to really preserve the life essence of a person is perfect for volumetric capture. Um, Tell us about your relationship with Fred Hampton. They okay. okay. There was a need when we started, and that need is still there for um, the narrative to be reclaimed by the people who lived it and, and experienced it. Fred Hampton was an amazing human being. Dynamic, energizing, our ability to translate raw data into a meaningful human experience is everything. That is why natural language understanding is indeed one of the long-running goals of AI. Now, for a project like this, what we're applying is our latest natural language models called Turing. It allows us to create these meaningful conversational experiences and to create knowledge networks so that the viewer can uncover Latin insights and connections that will really enable them to have their own personal experience. 69, we staged a walkout. As a result of that walkout, me and my buddy Gary, we both got kicked out. This is our senior year, a couple of months before graduation. So I come home that day from the walkout. My mother finds out about the walkout on the These U. technologies will allow our audiences, not only people of today, but people for generations to come, as well as the Black Panther Party members themselves, to be able to experience their stories in a way that connects them in a human way to the history behind their legacy. One of Fred's powers as a leader was his ability. This is amazing in, in, in a number of ways. Number one, we're making history today. Michael McCarty is the first Black Panther captured in 3D immersive XR technology. As we seek to make meaning of the memories of the Panthers and draw a correlation between what we're experiencing today in the United States and around the world, we can look to them for lessons on how to combat economic injustice, mass incarceration, and police brutality. This is us acknowledging that Iconic Black Panther is going to be in universities, it's going to be in uh, high schools at some point, and um, this is a logical extension of that. It's important for Black Panthers to tell their story now. This has been quite intriguing, an opportunity to share my stories and experiences utilizing a newish technology. I love it.